Hey, what's up, man? This is Frankie. Let me say I'm not a financial advisor. Anything that I say in this video is for entertainment purposes only. Whatever I say in this video is my opinion. May not necessarily be factual. Don't buy, sell, or hold a stock because of anything that I say in this video. Do your own DD. You know, when I look at the whole environment, the makeup of our short squeeze play in GTII and Finger, man, I'm extremely confident, especially, man, I'm excited to see what I'm, so, I'm seeing as far as the short squeeze plays are concerned. I know we're going to be successful. However, man, these bad actors and these criminal short sellers that's using, in my opinion, you know, all this security fraud and stock market manipulation to try to, try to short um, GTII and Finger, we should expect for these bad actors to engage in this type of stock market manipulation until they can't no more. You see what I'm saying? But that's what make these two short squeeze plays, these two short squeeze play so valuable. All the counterfeit shares, the means of shares that they're allegedly using to short these stocks. That's what make the play so valuable. You see what I'm saying? Every day you look at, every day if you look at the stock, man, these guys are using all these counterfeit shares, these fake shares to constantly push the stock price down. They're using these counterfeit shares to drive the stock price down. You see what I'm saying? And the sad thing is, these shares that they done sold, that they selling, they ain't even buying them back. They just using straight fraud. When what, uh, when what other industry can you go in, you can sell something, man, but you don't even have that particular merchandise. You don't buy it. You just selling it. You see what I'm saying? They selling retail investment, man, fake shares. And that's the way it is. But the thing is, when these bad actors, man, when they finally get caught and they can't do it no more, it's going to crush them. And that's when we're going to get paid. And see this, they, they, like I said, they're going to continue to use, and we should expect it. They're going to continue to use this security, this, this type of security fraud until they can't do it no more, until they get something like a margin call that they can't handle, until they go bankrupt until they end up going to jail. We should expect for them to continue to engage in this illegal stock market manipulation. But as retail investors, we all know this is not a regular stock play. We know we got in this to fight security fraud and to try to get a free and fair stock market. That's what it's all about. We know it's, we know what we signed up for. You see what I'm saying? So I think in our play, I think we got some of the most educated people, investors that you can have in the short squeeze play. And we're not leaving until the shorts cover their position. And see, we know what we hold it. We know what we holding is valuable. We know these bad actors, these criminal short sellers, they need our shares. And we know these shares is worth life changing money. We know that. You see what I'm saying? So the thing is, they can use all the fake shares they want to. They can the counterfeit shares. They can manipulate the price. They can engage in security fraud. They can do all that. But the fact of the matter is they ain't got no way to get out of these stocks unless they come through us. It's just that simple. Ain't no way out for these bad actors but up. That's when they got to cover these shorts. And the thing is, man, I'm going to close with this. You know, when it comes to, you know, the companies that's involved, you know, in our short squeeze play. When it comes to the legal team, they all are doing what they're supposed to do. We just got to play our position. Our position is simply this. On the dip, we accumulate and we damn ahead. That's it. That's all we got to do. Thanks for taking time out to watch the video. Have a nice day.